Hello, today once again I'm attempting the cell tower puzzle. This is a grid of letters as you can see and you simply have to divide them into words. So weather is a possibility. Uh, so within each word you read, or within each section rather, you read top to bottom, left to right. Um, we've got field and we've got brand, but it could be something like D brand perhaps and maybe there's something that comes before field as well. I do like little there though. I'm going to put that in. I'll take a risk because that fits quite nicely with brand. What's this E going to be part of? It has to be part of the word with the O, um, but that's too short. What's this Y going to be part of? Because it's not going to be a word that goes I-Y, so that's going to be something like that, perhaps. I still am a little bit worried about what's going to go on with these E's over here, but I think let's go with that for now. Um, so we've got positive. Oh, and a side, so I quite like that. I'm a little bit scared of what's going on with that X. I don't think this is correct anymore. Oh no, it could be, because it could be index. Uh, and this could be wished and deduce next to it. Um, so if it is deduce, what's going to happen with this I? Again, I don't think it's going to go with the Y next to it, so I'm not too confident about that. Let's try and fill in this bit down here. Uh, well, it could be tonal. But again, if it is tonal, we don't know which T. And also, I don't know what would be going on with this E. Unless tonal is a word, which apparently it's not. So I might have to rub out some words in a second, but let's try and tidy this part up first. There's yours. Um, yes, I like that because then we can have succeed without the N. Dies just to fill in that gap, and then we've got uh, print out. So we do have total, and we've got on field, but then what's going to be happening with this E? I think that has to be total. One field is not a word. Oh, it's every one, isn't it? So it is just field. And I'm going to have to remove and select every. So I haven't quite got it perfect. I had to make one slight adjustment, which is what this thing, the uh, sequence of symbols tries to, tries to symbolize which is a fairly clever way of doing it, if you know what it's talking about. That basically means I I went sideways once, rather than just going all the way across. Because after I put in the word every, I was still the same number of steps away from the correct answer, effectively. Um, but we got there in the end. Definitely didn't make as big of a mess as some of the recent puzzles of this that I've done, so extended my streak to two, which is always nice. Um, let me know how you got on. Thank you for watching and bye for today.